What's up, what's up, everybody? Henry from Fun Game Reviews. All right, guys. Officially, I got my Arcane Caster finally enlightened. I got her to level 16 uh, just to kind of see how much more damage uh, she will actually do for me, uh, specifically when I am uh, attacking in the Gale Boss. So here we go, guys. We are going to be fighting Arcane Elder. Uh, so let's kind of see what we got that basically showing you guys pretty much similar setup uh, like normal uh, nothing too fancy here we want to make sure we change back to toxic shaman uh, but yeah hopefully this way I should be doing a lot more damage I mean I I should be tanking better I should be doing overall better damage and and everything so let's go ahead and try it out let's go launch her out and literally, you know, as as normal, I, I tell you guys that I focus specifically on trying to see how much my damage output would increase. All right, so we'll we'll kind of see it out right now. We'll we'll play it out like this, and we'll we'll see if uh, if this would work out. I don't know if it will work out perfectly or or what. Uh, but let's see here. We're gonna wait for the first pushback. And literally start the start this uh, divine right before the pushback. So there you go, looking good. And then let's get ready to get a little bit of heals for her. Ooh, she's going down. All right. So, but she has uh, that divine now. So let's go ahead and uh, take advantage of the divine. Let's put that bubble down from Toxic Shaman to help out a little bit additionally on those heals. So very freaking nice. Look at that. Everybody is shining and glowing here. So definitely we are pushing a hell of a lot more damage. Look at that. We're definitely pushing a lot more damage out on her. So, I mean, on him. So it's definitely looking perfect. Freaking nice. All right, guys. So literally we're, what we're waiting for is uh, we're, we're going to wait till the about, let's just say the next pushback. And then after the next pushback, we will definitely move on. Uh, but right here, let's go ahead. We'll make sure that we're still getting heals. And uh, with that being said, one second left. Very nice. Look at that. We are able to push uh, the the boss here. Let's go ahead and put on that divine as well. We are keeping very much alive here. It is looking splendid. We're in the dots. We're having it so that we're pushing pretty dang hard. Guaranteed. Big damage. And we got some mad heals from uh, Toxic Shaman as well. So... 63 million <laughs> dude and i only have her at level 16 enlightenment i am definitely going to be bringing her to level 22 oh my god that def holy smokes that bro that destroy wow my damage shot up like tenfold just because i freaking enlightened my arcane caster wow Wow, I am re- Wow! Oh my god, that was ridiculous. Wow! That is how you guys know that having her enlightened really makes a huge, huge difference. Damn! I'm so happy about this right now. Like, you guys don't even understand. Literally, you guys are going to see a lot more damage coming out, uh, specifically because Arcane Caster and everything. You guys know, like, that my strategy mostly was to, to start building my Guild Clash, my Lord's League teams first. Once I finished up my Guild Clash, Lord's League team, I basically move on into, like, my Guild Boss. Um, I mean, like, Coliseum stuff, I've never had that big of a problem uh, I, ha I haven't had that much problems that it's like, oh my god, I need to do this or that, you know. So let's go ahead, do a little bit of pushback right now. Very freaking nice. Uh, oh, dude, she's shooting at the wrong freaking person right now. Uh, but the nice thing is, because it's shooting it up, like, due to the fact that it has enlightenment, even though that person is taking damage, it is still reflecting a lot of damage. Uh, so remember, as she gets enlightened, she actually reflects uh, damage taken by 
her allies as well. So it's not like, oh my god, we, we just realized this. But yeah, it's quite remarkable, guys. Quite remarkable. Let's go ahead and top him off. Oh, even the top off didn't work off as, uh, as well as it's supposed to. But uh, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and use that divine. And let's go ahead and start pushing back. Ugh. Oh, this one was a little bit more miserable compared to the last few hits I did. But look at that. Even with that, look at that. Still reflecting crazy amounts of damage. And we still, at the very last few seconds, we hit 62. Dude, even though I thought I screwed that one up, I still hit 62 million. So it looks like 62 million might be my base. And I actually screwed up. So that means I should have actually probably done better damage. Uh, literally, I think I would have done better damage. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead. We're doing this again. Let's go ahead and start pushing and pressing as much damage as possible. I am loving this. I am loving the fact that she is so much more OP. So much more heals. Oh, so nice. Ridiculously nice. All right. I'm excited. I got her a level 30 skill. Very freaking awesome. Everything about it right now, I'm just like, I'm just happy, dude. I am literally just happy. Let's go ahead, Abyss Demon. Let's go with the Abyss Demon skill. There you go. Abyss Demon should get some uh, big damage out there. Oh, dude, that did not work out as intended there. Uh, but uh, let's go ahead and max out that skill. Oh, dude, I just realized I did not use my Divine there. Let's go ahead and use that Divine right now to uh, help out a little bit with a little bit of pushback damage. Um, and then let's go ahead and return that. All right. Looking good, looking good. We want to put some bubbles down as well so that uh, it does heal the majority of my heroes. Looking splendidly well. And uh, let's go ahead keep on doing that damage. Very nice. Okay. So we're at 30 million damage. We have everybody pretty much alive at this point. And, and we are doing the best that we can. So we're going to try to hold it off uh, a little closer to uh, the end here. So let's see. As of right now, let's go ahead and start pushing that damage back right now. Uh, we definitely want to top everybody off. Let's put that Toxic Shaman bubble down. We are getting a lot of pushback. So let's go ahead and keep on pushing back as much as we can. We want to survive. Look at that. Everybody is reflecting. Everybody's reflecting. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, this one, even though everybody's alive, we're doing less damage. No. <laughs> Why did we do less damage that last round? I don't know. But 63 million damage. Looking good. <laughs> All right, guys. Henry from Fun Game Reviews. I am freaking excited. I'm freaking happy. Uh, now we're going to get a chance to play with the Hero Aids a little bit more and try out new things. I mean, having it set up like that, I can still kind of see that she does kind of die a little fast. She does die kind of quickly there. Uh, but we'll see how much uh, damage wise uh, we will actually do. So thanks for watching Henry from Fun Game Reviews here. Peace out.